CFR Network, CFR News. Good day, good night, all. Brother Dawood, aka David Bailey, unfortunately has transitioned. And very, 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 very surprisingly, I don't see any tributes that have directly been put out titled you know i haven't heard i've heard one person with a, a sizable platform mention that brother Dawood has transitioned and that was frankie aka sarnetta that was only in passing you know <laughs> Now, don't get it twisted. I don't consume any of his content. I haven't in, in some years. So, and I did quickly scroll through to see if there's anything titled, you know, da Brother Dawood or anything. I don't see nothing, nothing whatsoever. I know, obviously, he was very disrespectful. He has some very disrespectful words about Brother Dawood. Uh, I won't even get into what was said, you know, and other people. But ultimately, Brother Dawood came through with the energy, with the information, with the knowledge. Uh, the persona, the personage, the person themselves. Sometimes it's just about the information. You've got to leave the person alone because you may not agree with what they're doing. You know, uh, to themselves, maybe, but ultimately, Brother Dawood was a staple up until the ooh, I would say mm, mid 2000s, maybe even to mm, I know I say a bit long, yeah, mid 2000s, maybe up to 2012, maybe. Putting out some tremendous information now. Unfortunately, within this, the, within the so-called con black conscious community and other communities, quote unquote conscious alt media, etc., you get parasitical people who just want to take advantage of people and you know take the piss. Ultimately, um, and he was. As many lecturers at the time, Bobby Himmett, um, Phil Valentine, Dalva Blair, Rising Paradise. This has been so many that all crossed paths or did lectures together and stuff and put out some real good information. Some of it was faulty. We have to um, be grown enough to, to say that uh, these scholars, these quote-unquote master teachers are not... Uh, without blemish, all their information isn't one hundred percent correct. At times, yes, indeed, we, we it's um, to the points, on points. It is the truth, but it's as I say, it's just so disappointing to see the the decline. I mean, if you you type in, go into the old boob tube and type in brother Dawood, and you in the golden area of or the golden age, I should say, of the old YouTube, a.k.a. BooTube. There was nothing but a Brother Dawood content. There was a guy from London who used to who used to sell DVDs. He used to do, you know, some excellent editing, and he would edit together Dawood material and other scholars and put visuals to it and all that. I can't remember what the guy's name is. But going back to, like, as I say, 2012 and, and, and before. Um, even I had up some Brother Dawood. I reposted some Brother Dawood content because it was revolutionary. It was the presentation. There was a lot of profanity, I will say. There was a lot of profanity. He was very energetic. Um, he had a persona, uh, very akin to, I would say, 
Dr. Khalid Mohammed, Rising Paradise, but just turn it up and use profanity. Strong brother, uh, with his uh, forever faithful cookie, sister cookie, elder cookie. The seven what seven one seven one what the what was it seven one three nine Millennium Collective. I won't even repeat any of the jewels, but if anybody was um, exposed to uh, Brother Dawood, you will know.